We got a lot of amazing new features with the new update, but my favorite new feature is the new mute effects for Neuromix. So in this video, I'm just gonna show you where to find it, how to use it, and how to get the most out of it. The first one is obviously gonna be here in our features. We have Neuromix, we have cue points, loops, effects, and equalizer. So if we are in the Neuromix section, there is going to be this little kind of sound icon, I guess that's called, and then you press it down, and then here are our, our options. So you could turn mute effects on, press it again, and you could choose one beat, three fourths beat, and a half a beat. What's really exciting is this type of drop down menu could be expanded. So maybe we'll get like a mute effects reverb or a mute effects flanger or other effects or even a scratcher. But right now we just have echo out effects, which really adds, uh, really polishes your mix, really adds something special when you get rid of the vocals with that little echo there. It's small and subtle, but it really makes a big difference in the mix, in my opinion. So that's one way to find it. Another way to find it is if you press these feature buttons now, it used to only be for narrow mix, but we could change it to different features now. But if you're in the narrow mix section and you press this drop down menu, you could turn on our mute effects. So let's just leave it on. Let's turn it off and see what it sounds like when we get rid of the vocals without it, and then see what it sounds like when we get rid of the vocals with it. So it kind of just cuts out like that. It doesn't really sound polished or professional, no echo to it. Now listen to it with the mute effects on. So it adds a more professional, it kind of echoes that go, makes it sound a lot better. I really like it. So that was with one beat. Let's do a uh, half a beat so we can tell the difference from one beat to half a beat. So you get more of an echo. I think it sounds better with the one beat because you could actually get the word that it's saying. So it's a really cool feature. Just practice getting your timing right and then getting rid of the vocals at the right time so you get the full word. I'm still practicing this, but you want it to have the full word and then echo into it. And then you could use this for mashups. You could play the lyrics of a different song. You could break into a scratch acapella section you could really let your creativity run wild and if you want to see my full tutorial on neural mix with the new update check out this video over here thank you